And we're back in the, well, we're called Match Days with Bill. That sounds a bit lame if I'm totally honest, but we're back. Another game pre season. We're doing a Lincolnshire derby today. It's just another short one for me, but like I say, it's good to be back. Good to have the two teams back, which is Botsford against Brig. So, a few people that I haven't seen in a while, be good to have a catch up with them. View around here, like, subscribe to the channel, we're on the way to 3,000 subscribers. And, yep, this is our second pre season game of the season. I'm like I say, very excited. There'll be plenty more pre-season games to come throughout the month. And uh, I say we're ticking ever close to the start of the season. It's coming around so fast. Yeah, quicker than my car, that's for certain. But we'll see you in Scunny. So the last time I came here was about two years ago, just over about two and a half years ago now, and the ground is completely different to what I last saw it. It was, it was grass. There was a little bit of progress as well, and also they had a big Taco Bell sign at the far end, which obviously they've taken that down, which is a real shame. But <laughs> so, overall, I think you can see where the club is going in terms of direction, and with the 3G pitch, they can hire it out for ages and ages, make some money on it, and I think for a club. Certainly step five, step six, it's absolutely vital. You know, the extra income coming into the football club. So, for me, I think it's, I think what they've done, I think it's a great project. One thing I'm digging as well, I'm really liking this as well, because you see all these famous players that play for Boxford. Beckham, Shearer, Gerrard. And of course, Erling Haaland has all played for Boxford. There's one thing as well I really like Briggs kit. Reminds me of like a Belgium or like a Southampton kit from back in the day. Really digging it to be fair. So then, step five versus step six as Dancing in the Moonlight is playing. Great tune. Hope it doesn't get copyrighted. Um, I'm going to go 2 1 to. Hmm. I do you know what? I'm going to go 2 1 Briggs today. I think it'll be a close game, but I say, I think for pre season, you want close games, a bit of exercise. And also for me, Get out of this for football. As I spot an absolute legend over there, he's a good mate of mine, Charlie. Yep, taking all the football in and it's live. Well, not now, but yeah, now it is. There we go then. Like someone's having a party over there, to be fair. Although it is the club, the clubhouse behind there, so yeah, great tune. Oh, and that ball's out of here. I did find when uh, I was last here, there was loads of footballs going that way, so yeah. I mean, someone needs to be a ball boy. Good space. Back post. Surely. Oh dear me. He didn't do anything, he fluffed it. He got his legs on the wrong feet. Also, I need to give a shout out to that referee. He actually watches the video, so big up to him. And also, I'll make sure I get some of your good decisions today and not any of the bad ones. There's a race on here. First time. Look at that, composure in its finest. That's the ball. 1v1 him then. I'll save, keep. He looks a bit annoyed there, I have to say. Yep. Keeps. Go on, first time then. Oh, wow. Close enough. Crap check for the line now. Definitely wearing those night tempos, that's for certain. Must have gone for Sports Direct. Normally it would be like Tempos, World Cups or Puma Kings. It's like the three main boots that the liner wears. That or centre house. Oh! Oh, he's... Oh! Oh, wow. That's got to hurt. I'll tell you what, he's going to feel that, all right. That's going to be a bit of a sore one. This is going in the net, this. Chuff it now. Chuff it now. They've scored. Joe you know for all the Briggs pressure. And they get done on counter attack. 1 0. I put the camera down and Boss would have got a penalty. <laughs> okay. Well, they've got a chance. Oh, it's been saved. Well, I'll tell you what, he's done well to claw it out. We go first time. 
Ball's a bit of quality then. Near post. What a save. Oh. What a save from keeper then. Wowzers. Good place right. That's the ball. You give it some defender. That's the ball. Bit of quality. Oh. I waited for a bus that was. That's the ball. 1v1 in there now. Oh. Still got it. Go on. Go on. Oh, great ball. He's in. That's a great finish. Tell you what, Brie had deserved that, to be fair. But then, up until that goal, it has been a classic case of creating chances, but not taking it, but great goal. Breaks on. Go on, 1v1 him then. Oh! That ball's out of here. Breaks on. First time. Oh! Is it for... What a save! He's like Jordan Pickford. And there we go. 1-1, one, one, and to be fair, it has been a good game. But for all of Briggs' chances, Botsford were pretty good. He took the lead, albeit penalty, yeah, I think referee's got that right. Good save from keeper, but yeah, the quality from Briggs at first half has really showed, but probably should be 2-3-1 up right now, but could come back and bite him, that's for certain. On the back side. Now we're back on the way. Let's just hope this isn't the unlucky number. Giving the goalkeepers 13. I'm going to nick a line from Smith here and send justice for stewards. Is a thing at Botsford. Oh, it's away. Is this 2 1? Mm. Oh. To be fair, I have to say, Big Play's got a point. Hit it. Touch across. What a ball! That's a chance. Oh, he's in. Surely. That's the biggest shit house I've seen. That was the biggest shit house I've seen. He's giving it you some there. <laughs> Two on break. Oh, go on then. Oh, save. It was like nothing and then he just saved it. Prep check, new boost you can see, sports direct. Go on then, take him on, go on. Oh nice. Oh save. Surely. Oh, body's on the line, I love it, love it. Oh they've scored. Shit. 3-1. <laughs> Well, they actually hit the crossbar, which, yeah, earlier, and I've just got the goal. Well then. And the absolute worst thing as well is it started raining. Why does it always rain on me? Run away. Oh, bloody hell. Well, well then. That's the ball. Oh. Sold in the dream there. Come on then. Oh, that's a great goal. That's a great goal. Comebacks on then. I'm thinking goal. Bloody hell. Well, that's it. All done. <laughs> that would have been some goal. Let's speak of a sec. So there we go then. I tell you what, I really enjoyed myself for Botsford today. It was really nice. I think the, the changes they've done at the football club are think fantastic and I felt today, you know, it was one of those where, you know, judging on the performance, look, they've lost 3-2 to a side that's that's a league below them, but, you know, there was times where I felt, you know, they were in the game, they, they moved the ball nicely, yeah, they did give the ball away cheaply, but, you know, they, they took the goals well, um, but for me, I thought Brig were, I was really impressed with them today, actually, Brig. Um I think they're going to be a team that's going to be really up there this season, challenging for the playoffs. Even though you never know, they might even be up there for the title this season. But look, it's still early days. But this is probably first or second sort of pre-season game for a lot of these teams. But I have to say, on the balance of it, I've been really impressed with Brig. Bosford, look, they've got a long way to go. They're not going to be match sharp just yet. But 
early signs. Look, there's some good ones, but there we go. Uh, really enjoyed it today. We're back on Tuesday with another video. You know what to do? Smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and uh, yeah, see you very soon.